it's coming to a time now that it's over. And what I want to tell you now is, is right before I came back into my body, Jesus looked at me and he said, months before I come back to get you, they're going to talk about aliens a lot. It's one of the signs. And this is in 2014. He said, they're going to talk about aliens a lot. Like it's going to become a big deal. And he told me, you'll know and to be watching for the great deception that's about to take place. There's going to be something take place. There's an event, you'll see. There's a great deception. It's all set up. Whenever the um, lady at the beginning, when I told you she was frantic screaming, the aliens come, it's going to be talked about in the media like all the time. It's going to start to become like, I almost to say the norm. And it almost is, isn't it? Kind of interesting where we are from 2014 to 2021. The government's talking about it. It's it's almost becoming uh, taboo, right? I mean, hello. Yeah, I went to sleep, and in the middle of the, my sleep, all of a sudden, I was. I don't know if I was in my body or out of my body. Uh, I don't know how it happened. I don't, all I know is all of a sudden I was standing with Jesus and, and he was on my right hand the whole time in this experience. He grabbed a hold of my hand and um, I'll go from there. Uh, the first, uh, I will call it a scene per se of what I saw was as Jesus was standing on my right hand, he had a hold of my hand and we were in a town. I don't know what town we were in. I know that there was a big white building over to the, over to the side right here. And uh, I was looking up at this big white building and I was looking up at the sky and there was, the sky was alive. It was like it was moving. It was, it was, it was, it was full of lightning. It was very uh, spooky looking, but um, I looked out over the horizon and there was, a, there was this lady running towards me and she started screaming. They were all just screaming in terror. They were all freaking out. It was, it was, it was incredible. And, and they were saying, uh, they're gone, they're gone. And I said, Who, who's gone? And I told this lady, I said, who's gone? And she said, did you not see? And I said, did I not see what, ma'am? I said, what, what, are you, what are you talking about? And at this time, she could see me. Not, not every time uh, in these, this experience were able, people were able to see me. Uh, in, this, in this instance, she was. She, she could not see Jesus, but she could see me. And she said, the aliens... She said, the aliens came and got the Christians. And I said, the aliens? She said, yes, they all, they all disappeared. They went up. And um, I, I, at that moment, she just ran off. She was frantic. She just ran off. She was screaming in terror. Just ran, it ran as fast as she could. She was ah, like panicking. And I looked out over the uh, her horizon of the city. I was up like on a hill at this time and I could see everything on fire. Everything was on fire. The cars, the houses, the buildings. You could, uh, it was like, like chaos beyond anything you could ever comprehend was happening at this time. And you could smell the smoke you could, people were looting. They were stealing out of cars. They were stealing out of buildings. They were doing everything. They were, they were trashing this city of where I was at. I was just looking across the city going, oh my gosh, what is going on? 
And all of a sudden, we translated, we left, we left that spot and went to another spot. He grabbed my hand, we we're, were still holding hands, but it's like we went poof and we just, we went, we just disappeared and we, we came to another time. And in this time frame now, I'm looking and um, I'm looking over Europe. I know I was looking over Europe, but because I was standing back, but I was like watching a movie. It was it was very strange, and I was looking out over over uh, Europe, and I saw this man, and he was in Berlin, and all the world leaders were behind this table. It was a round table in Berlin. It was a big like a like an office looked like it was this brown table and there was chairs all around it and all of these big leaders world leaders were all behind this this um this big table and he, and this man i don't know who he was at the time i do do know you know later on i'll tell you and all of the people were were asking him for help they were asking him for a solution to all the rioting, to all the craziness that was going on. And he um, was instructing them on what to do. He had all the wisdom. He was, he was very, very powerful in demeanor, the way he carried himself. He was wearing a, a gray suit and um, he, was a, he was a Middle Eastern man. This is the next scene I see. Uh, I see him come on TV and he's on TV on CNN, Fox, everybody. He's on TV and he is, he is telling all the people that are of the world uh, what happened to the people that disappeared. And he was explaining to the people on TV that, um, that uh, they were rebellious. They were, they were taken away and re, out of rebellion and that they were being, they were punished. All these people were punished. It was the Christians and they were all being punished and they were taken out. And then I, he was just explaining that he was the new leader of the world. And, um, I look out and, and I, and I see over, um, it was just kind of, it was gradual how he was taking power 